Hey guys, Joe here, and you guys are looking at my phone while I'm looking through my phone at you guys, although now I'm looking at you. Because I wanted to show you guys that I now have a Canon ELF 115IS. It's not a bad little thing. I watched a bunch of YouTube videos, and for what I got that thing for, it will serve purposes fine until I start making some better checks at my new job. Uh, the bloggy is sitting on another camera stand, and I'm going to buy a third camera stand because I got these stands for five bucks or whatever it was at a thrift shop. Um, I also wanted to show my setup the way it's currently sitting, and I will do that in a second. Uh, it's a huge mess because I'm reorganizing things. I turned that into just a thingamajigger, so I'm going to switch cameras. So, anyways. There you go. I wanted to compare the footage between my phone and you, the camera, and show you guys a difference. I'm sure you can pick up that I am already sweating ball. The reason for that is AC still doesn't work and I can't afford one of those portable AC units right now. So, wah. Anyways. So I have that old, old Sharp Aquas TV that I hook up to all my old systems sitting there. Laptop for rendering everything screen for the Xbox 360 as well as the PS3 and down here I sorted out the games alphabetically for the 360 and some random stuff here I've got a GameCube that's the one I showed you yesterday or the day before that my buddy gave me uh, some games that I haven't put away yet as well as a few things to show you so I removed the crate and used the Halo Reach box that I completely forgot that I had in order to stack up the Iron Man. And if you look up there, I have an Iron Pen Iron Man. So yeah, that's kind of cool. That's Song of the Deep. It's the sealed collector's edition with the book. My coworker had pre-ordered this, but we all wound up getting free copies of it digitally. So he didn't want this anymore. He was gonna cancel it. And I said, hey, I've got the credits from old trade-ins sitting there. So I went ahead and took this from him. Uh, just a cool thing to have. It's sealed. It'll stay with my sealed stuff. Uh, good news for collectors. If you are a GameStop trader, you can trade for cash and get the same amount as trade starting on Monday. So that'll be a cool bonus. Wanted to show you guys one of the projects I had worked on. If you remember, this was really shiny. It was a proof of concept just to see how well paint would stick to it. And Unlike other people, I actually use a product called Bulldog. It's an adhesion promoter when I did it. I sanded that down and now I just got to put a little bit of putty to fill in the little cracks and then I will paint it correctly. Or I may just leave it flat like that because I think it looks really kind of cool. But I'm weird that way. So the camera that I'm currently using as well as this, oops, that didn't get plugged in, Nintendo 64 with expansion pack I got from my buddy at the pawn shop. Now he gave me a good deal like he normally does and I apologize again it's just that hot. Uh, they said that the 64 didn't work. I could see that the pins were just a little rusty. I haven't taken it apart yet but I intend to. But he gave me everything for 10 bucks and then the camera was like 40 bucks. And the camera was well worth more than 40 bucks. So I'm happy I have that because it had the battery, the charger, the box everything I needed to just get in and go. So I am not hurting when it comes that way. So yeah, hopefully this setup will stay like this for a little while. Um, if you notice, two of the videos went private and that would be the original Thumper Got Hit video as well as the update. Now, if you've seen those videos, you'll know that I never named the guy that hit me nor did I say anything derogatory other than he was a son of a bitch. Whatever, I don't care, that was anger coming through. But I never, tampered with my car after I brought it back. As I said in the video, I didn't want to damage the vehicle anymore until the adjuster and claims people looked at it. So I've taken those down for now. A family friend who deals with insurance companies told me it would be best not to have that up, even though nothing I said in it differed at all from the statement I gave because it's all 100% the truth. But in the efforts of continuing to move this along i'm not going to put those back up until after it's handled maybe i'll put them all together as one video who knows but yeah that video will go up and then i will track it as it gets repaired they want me to tow it to a repair facility for an inspection which i'm going to do tomorrow or today depending on when you see this so other than that not much else going on um 
one of my favorite movies. You should watch it if you haven't watched it. Watch it. And watch the Blu-ray version if you can because it has more stuff on the disc. And my right ear just popped. I can't hear anything out of my right ear real quick all of a sudden. Really weird. Uh, could be the heat. I don't know. I'm not sure. The office doesn't have AC still, so I'm very, very, very warm. And uh, on that note, I'm going to go away. Please leave me a comment if you have a comment to leave me. If you have any suggestions on future videos, leave those there. I am going to go and sit in a bucket of ice or something and turn the fans on and get cooled down because I am very, very hot. You can see how badly I'm sweating, and this is after five minutes. So, until we talk again, see ya! <sighs> the funnest part about new technology is remembering to hit record on it. So, yeah. <laughs> I just talked for four minutes and nobody was listening. Story of mine life. So, the light, the light. Oh, wow, look at that thing. Try to white balance that out. Here we go.